Hey, what's up guys? Back with the second video as promised. Um, and this one again is by uh, Alec. Um, and this is going to be for the camphering tool. Um, I'll show you the on the back side here. Actually, let me take it out of the stupid plastic because it is reflective. And I'm not in the mood for reflective. Um, so if you guys can read Japanese, there you go. Um, let's see here. Uh, Alec, we are a special brand of useful tool for hobby. Um, there's that for those that can read. Do, 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 do. Uh, again, this is saying, um, the plats uh, dash hobby.com. I have not looked that up though. I will once I am done filming these videos. Um, so this is going to give you do, 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 do. Let me make sure it's all in focus for you guys or try to. I think it is there. Um, so the dimensions of it are, I believe 60 millimeters by 45 millimeters. Um, and this is what this is for is doing sharpening your edges of your kits cleaning those seam lines off of um, rounded parts uh, truing up edges and also thinning out certain pieces um, you'll see here you have a rounded 20 degree uh, a rounded 7.5 um, you have a negative and positive 90 degree you have a 135 um, different 135 you have all these different angles that you can do it at um, you have these slots here that are for 1.5 millimeter and 1 millimeter um, you have a 35 degree longer uh, 135 longer degree angle uh, you get a right 1.5 right 1 and right 0.5 and then this over here is just showing you how you can end up using using the tool, uh, whether it be shaving on rounding pieces, thinning out and truing, um, or this. The main purpose of me getting this is I want to get into more scratch building, um, and this is going to be one of those tools that uh, comes in extremely handy. At least I think it will be. Um, this is going to be used for. One, you can use it for cleaning off seam lines off of pieces like, uh, let's uh, just say this round. It's not styrene or anything, but it will work. Um, do, 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 do. You can use it in this fashion. You want to use it at an angle. Now this is, how thick is this? Uh, I think it's like one millimeter thick. Well, it says 0 0.01 millimeter thick. Um, but yeah, I think it's one millimeter thick um, Bigger pieces you can use this edge um, But this is going to be handy on rounded pieces If you want to take this and you want a little bit funkier angle You would just end up pinning it down And just keep repeating Now it's not going to do anything on here. Well, you know what? I have these. This is styrene. And let's see. Do, 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 do. I wanted to show you the seam because I know there's one on here. I believe it runs up right up this way. And I'm trying to do Now you don't have to do this many swipes to like clean off seam lines. And I'm just doing this to kind of make a point. I am super happy to have this. Uh, 
and you do want to drag it at an angle yes there is a point here guys so you can see your shavings off of there and I don't know if you be able to tell if I hold it up there la 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 Um, you're probably not going to be able to tell but it is already working to shape it into a wedge shape so this is uh, come in very handy um, this was after shipping and everything I think it was like $30 um, again pricey but um, very worth it um, as an, a tool in your arsenal um, again handy your magnets to stick to it um, it will stick to your magnet bar and that's one of my favorite things on there um, but if you are going to get into doing customs things like that uh, doing your own shaping and stuff um, do an investment spend the you know spend the thirty dollars pick it up um, I don't know if Hobby Search carries this, but if it does, I will throw a link on there. Um, otherwise, I will throw the link of where I got it, which uh, was on Amazon. Um, I think it uh, was like it gave an estimation of like the end of April, May, if I did the free shipping. Um, or if I did expedited shipping through Amazon, which was only four dollars and eighty six dollars eighty six cents more, I got it here EMS in less than a week from Japan. So you cannot beat that. Um, so great tool, guys. Uh, if you get a chance, try it out. You will see this in upcoming videos, uh, especially my how tos when I'm going over stuff, and uh, it's just kind of comfortable. It's kind of going to probably turn into my you know fidget piece um, because when I do vi videos and stuff like that when you don't see my hands I'm usually fidgeting on something and uh, I have a feeling this might end up being it um, so I will talk to you guys all later everyone have a great night and uh, peace out